Hello guys, welcome to this lecture on keying concepts. Our topic is secondary key. What is secondary key? We know that primary key is used to access only unique record and it is not null. Many times we need to access specific records of a table using the values of one or more attributes other than the primary key. Such attributes on which we need to access the records of a table that may not compulsory to return unique record is called the secondary key. In a scenario where more than one record is required, for example, we want to see how many of our students belong to city of Multan. In that case, we will access those instances or records of the student table that contain Multan in their address. So in this situation, more than one record is possible. In this case, the city will be called secondary key since we are accessing records on the basis of its value and it is not necessary that we will get a single record. The name is also a secondary key. Keep one thing in mind here that a particular access to the value of a secondary key may return a single record. It is also possible only single record is available which fulfill the condition it is not necessary for secondary key to return a unique record. This is an important point to remember in case of super candidate primary and alternate keys it is necessary that they will always return unique record against a particular value. Name, city, class and date of birth all are secondary keys. If we want to retrieve the name of a student, it is possible more than one student has the same name and also same case with the city, class and date of birth. Please guys subscribe us on YouTube, like us on Facebook. My dear students, See you in next lecture. Have a nice day.